Today's video is sponsored by JC Squared. JC Squared is a YouTuber and he started to make merch on Accelerators Racers and World Race. Not only are the shirts looking very cool, they're also very comfy and looks really great in real life. On the shop you can find t-shirts, phone cases, stickers, mugs and a lot more stuff. There is also a brand new collection of hoodies that just came out. Go check out his online store, everything you need is in the description below. Now let's go back to the video. Warning, I had this video ID a long time ago, but before I had the time to write it and to make the video, Falcon released his video of Infinite Loop about the possible futures of the films. But that was a long time ago, and my video was very different from his. So, enjoy! Hey guys, welcome, I hope you're ready for this big subject, maybe the biggest one i ever done on this channel. So sit back and relax, take your bucket full of popcorn and your soda, like and subscribe, we're going to do an in-depth analysis of the entire timeline of the World Race and Acceleracers universe. From the distant past, to the present, and to the possible futures of the series. So, are you ready? At the beginning, there was nothing, and then, the light. Our universe was created from the impossible, the improbable. Billions and billions of years later, the Earth was born, and the first light that started to form strive on this little fragile piece of rock. This is where we start our journey. Around 4500 and 2500 million years ago, in the eon of Hadean or Archean, when only the first microscopic life began to appear on this rocky planet, the first intelligent being set foot on the planet. These ultra-intelligent beings will be known millions of years in the future as the Accelerons. They somehow knew about the future of arrival of the humans and started building their tracks. After finishing their work, they wrote and hid an ancient inscription so that in the future, being intelligent enough can find these tracks. They knew that it was only a matter of time. Then, thousands of years ago, while waiting for the humans to learn how to drive, they created the drones, with the only goal to win the race. But the drones sadly became rogue and decided to race into the racing realms that the Exerons created. But it was not made for them, so the Exerons banned them on the Earth to wait for the humans to learn what they left for them. Do you hear it? Our time has come. Between around 1950s and 1975, a man named Jack Rabbit Wheeler had a child. 
and named him Jack Jr. The Jack father started racing in 69, and the event of the Hot Wheels 1969 TV show occurred. Somewhere in the 70s or early 80s, Jack met a woman and fell in love with her. She gave birth to their child on the 2nd of December. They named him Bert Wheeler. Somewhere between 88 and 95, Bert's mother died or left his father. The reason is still unknown to this day. Then, somewhere in 2003, on Bert's 18th birthday, the event of World Race happens. I'm basing this on the fact that World Race came out on the 2nd of December in 2003, and that we can see the check date at the end of the movie in August 2003. What are you worried about, Marky? If this deal wasn't cool, I wouldn't go anywhere near it. And if something does go wrong, we'll be in it together. After the event of the world race, on some weeks or months later, Kurt and Marky are arrested. Marky goes to prison for two years. Then, somewhere in between probably some months after Kurt couldn't drive in the Grand Prix because of the arrestation, he and other drivers from the world race started to join the Teku or the Metal Maniac for street racing. Then, somewhere at the same time, Tesla tried to get the Wheel of Power back, but failed. Around two years after Marky's imprisonment, Gig go to get the other drivers, then some of them are lost in the realms, like Benji Castile, Dan Dresden, and Alec Wood. So this then needs to find the best. So Gig goes and get the other drivers. The event of Accelerators Racers 1 to 4 happens. This event takes place over a few weeks or a few months. It is still unknown to the present day. And after that, well, laughter we don't really know. So many shows and games were made after this. And some were referencing things or people from the movie. So, what could be or what could have been the future of Acceleracers? For our first timeline, we'll go over what the producers of the show thought of bringing in this unreleased season 2. We don't know much, but we have images of toys that would have been sold with the movies. We can see characters with different weapons and transforming cars. So what could have happened? Well, in this possible timeline, they may have designed transformable cars based on their drones technology to merge with their cars. This could have led to a showdown between the drones and the silencers teamed up with the Teku and the Metal Maniacs. This would have probably been closer to Battle Force 5 than the first season of Accident Racers. Many of the questions left unanswered would probably have been answered, but other questions would have met their arrival. The series would have sadly gone into a more toy-selling focused show than a story-driven one. Sadly or gladly, depending on where you stand, which both of them are valid, the show never saw this possible future. In a possible universe where Vulcan elaborated on this idea, Vern having to reset the timeline to create the event of Battle Force 5, you can see this video right here. The universe of Racers would have taken a totally separate path than the one we imagined, but this is only one of the possible futures. Another future that could have happened is from the not-so-famous TV show Team Hot Wheels. In this possible universe, the drivers would have gone back to the Accelerons and somehow made Hot Wheels City appear in our world. Then years later, the people would have started to live in the city 
and the drivers from World Race, we have started to train new drivers to become the next kind of drivers with the next kind of racing cars. The show would have taken place around a few decades after Exo Racer 4. The last timeline we can explore is one opened very recently, around two years ago, a game coming from nowhere called Infinite Loop arrived on every app store and stormed the community. Wow, I'm hungry. Why? Because this game presented a driver called Vert Wheeler as the tutorial guide. This created a big reaction within the community as this was the first time the name Vert Wheeler was ever mentioned since 2011 in Battle Force 5. But this could have been all, but as the updates kept going, new cars arrived and these cars were Acceleracer's cars with Acceleracer's paint job. This brought a lot of questions and theories. One of them was about the possible meaning of the presence of Bert Wheeler and the different cars. So this new timeline, maybe in this possible future, Bert has gone back and raced against the Accelerons with the help of the silencers and his friends. The Acceleron then transported Vert and the other drivers in the future, as Infinite Loops happens a hundred years in the future. This would explain his presence and the presence of many other cars, but not where the other drivers are. This is still a mystery. But with all these possible futures, which one of these is the real one? Well, actually, we'll actually never know. Because it doesn't really exist. The future is only what we make of it. That is why many people disagree with the script I have written. Over the years, we all made our mind on what should and should not be the future of Accelerate Racers. That's why the Edge existed. And so many projects bringing back Hot Wheels, trying to bring back Hot Wheels. But there will never be an honest answer because even with the toys that the Hot Wheels released and the design, maybe they would have changed it. And we still don't know the story of what it was. Like I said, the future is only what we make of it. Only together we can create the future of Acceleracers. Looking down on the cars on the highway Stream of taillights Everybody dancing together To so willingly sacrifice rights When people accept their cogs in the system Give up, we will conform Individual Looking down on the virgin and 